Mini PCs are exploding in popularity, packing the power of full-size desktops into compact and portable sizes. But with so many options out there, it's hard to pick the right model. In today's video, we'll be going over the top 5 mini PCs that offer the right mix of performance, features, and value. So, whether you need a mini PC for work, play, or an entertainment hub, we've got you covered. For more information and updated prices about the products mentioned, check the links in the description box below. Without further ado, let's dive in. Kicking off our list at the number 5 spot is the Byte 3 fanless mini PC from Azul. Azul is a company that specializes in making budget-friendly mini PCs and tech accessories for home and business use. The Byte 3 maintains Azul's reputation for affordable systems aimed at basic computing. Priced at just $199, the Byte 3 stands out as one of the most budget-friendly mini PCs available, without compromising on reliability or performance. Under the hood, you'll find an Intel Centron N3350 dual-core processor capable of reaching speeds up to 2.4 GHz. While it may not be a powerhouse, it handles lighter workloads with ease. Accompanying the processor is a modest 4GB of RAM and 64GB of eMMC storage. Sleek and compact, the Byte 3 boasts a plastic chassis measuring a mere 4.9 by 4.4 by 1.3 inches. Weighing less than 2 pounds, it effortlessly finds its place on your desk or can be discreetly mounted behind a monitor using the integrated base amount. One exceptional feature of the Byte 3 is its completely fanless design. This means you can bid farewell to noisy distractions as it operates in blissful silence. Whether it's in your bedroom, living room, or a noise-sensitive workplace, this mini PC blends seamlessly into your environment. When it comes to performance, the Byte 3 shines in handling everyday tasks like web browsing, streaming videos, paying bills online, and light office work such as word processing. With the addition of an SSD, it can even tackle some photo editing. However, it's important to note that it may not handle intensive gaming or resource-heavy creative work. Nonetheless, considering its price, it delivers remarkable value and performance in a compact, whisper-quiet package. Now, let's address a few downsides. The CPU might not be as powerful as some of its peers, and the storage space is relatively limited. Additionally, the lack of USB-C connectivity may not suit everyone's needs. Nevertheless, if you're seeking an entry-level mini PC that certainly won't break the bank, the Byte 3 is an outstanding option to consider. Moving up to the number 4 spot, we have the B-Link GTI. This model is pricier with an MSRP around $359, but you get much better performance and features. Inside the glossy black chassis, you'll find an 11th generation Intel Core i3 1115G4 processor. This offers a significant jump up from the Celeron in the Azul, with Intel's Core i3 giving you a fast dual-core CPU that can hit max speeds up to 4.1 GHz. For memory, the GTI is specced with 8GB of DDR4 RAM, which is decent for multitasking and having multiple apps open. Storage is a 256GB M2 PCIe SSD. Not so huge capacity, but very fast. The GTI has a good selection of ports, despite its small size. On the back, you get two USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports, one USB-C 3.2, HDMI, DisplayPort, Gigabit Ethernet, and a 3.5mm audio jack. Wireless connectivity is covered with Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.2 support. The GTI also comes with a vase mount if you want to attach it behind a display. In terms of performance, the B-Link GTI handles day-to-day -day tasks effortlessly. It can also manage light gaming, photo and video editing, and general productivity work thanks to that speedy 11th Gen Core i3 CPU. Just don't expect it to do intensive creative work or play AAA games on high settings. I really like the balance of performance, size, and connectivity the GTI offers. If you need a mini PC for office work, media streaming, light gaming, and more, it's a fantastic choice with very few negatives other than the high price. Now, we're cracking into the top three with the Ace PC AK3 Mini PC. This model, with its Core i5 processor, 16GB of RAM, and 512GB SSD, retails for around $500. So, it's definitely on the pricier side, but offers some killer specs and performance. At the heart of this powerhouse is an 8th generation Intel Core i5-8259U. This is a 4-core, 8-thread processor with max turbo clock of 3.8 GHz. Having a full quad-core i5 CPU gives the AK3 way more multitasking muscle and speed compared to the previous Core i3 and Celeron models. 
Backing up that fast CPU is a generous 16GB of DDR4 RAM, allowing you to easily run multiple apps simultaneously. For storage, it boasts a speedy 512GB NVMe PCI Express solid-state drive. Despite its powerful internals, the AK3 maintains a small footprint at just 5.9 inches square and 2.4 inches tall. It shouldn't take up much desk space, but still looks great with its aluminum alloy housing. Connectivity is a strength of the AK3. It gives you dual-band Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 5.0, HDMI, DisplayPort, four USB 3.0 ports, Gigabit LAN, and USB-C. Put all this together, and the Ace PC AK3 is a productivity powerhouse. The quad-core i5 CPU and 16GB of RAM let you blaze through tasks like photo or video editing, media encoding, running virtual machines, multitasking, and more. Even some light gaming is possible thanks to the integrated Intel UHD 620 graphics. Honestly, my only real complaint is the high price tag, but if you want a mini PC that can keep up with heavy-duty productivity work, the AK3 is easily one of the top contenders. Now for our runner-up pick. This next awesome mini PC excels not just at productivity, but also at high-speed gaming thanks to its dedicated graphics card. I'm talking about the Minis Forum Elite Mini HM50. This pint-sized powerhouse retails for $639 fully configured. For that price, you get a beast of a processor, an AMD Ryzen 5 5600H. This CPU not only has 6 cores and 12 threads, but also turbos up to a blazing fast 4.2 GHz. Backing that up is a discrete AMD Radeon RX 6600M GPU with 8GB of dedicated GDDR6 video memory. This allows you to play modern AAA games at high frame rates in 1080p. You also get 16GB of fast DDR4 RAM and a speedy 512 NVMe SSD. Other highlights are Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.0 built in. Despite its high-performance parts, the HM50 takes up just 5.5 liters of volume. Basically, if you want desktop-level gaming ability in a mini PC that takes up hardly any space, the HM50 is one of the best options out there. It also demolishes productivity tasks, media editing, game emulation, and more. I really have no major cons to mention about the HM50 other than the high price. But for this combination of gaming prowess plus mini PC portability in one package, I think the price is 100% justified. Finally, we present to you the B-Link SER3. Priced at $389, the SER3 isn't cheap, but offers you extremely powerful performance similar to a high-end laptop, all while maintaining a tiny footprint measuring just 4.96 by 4.45 by 1.57 inches. Inside, you'll find an Intel Core i5-8259U quad-core CPU. This is the same generation chip used in the Ace PC AK3, but while the AK3's i5 maxes out at 3.8GHz, the SER3 can hit 3.8GHz turbo boost. The CPU is backed up by Intel Iris Plus 655 graphics. Don't expect hardcore gaming, but light games and graphics tasks run smoothly. You also get 16GB of RAM and a speedy 512GB PCI Express SSD. Connectivity is amazing with Wi-Fi 6, Bluetooth 5.0, dual HDMI and mini DisplayPort, USB-C with power delivery, four USB 3.0 ports, 2.5GB LAN, and 3.5mm audio. Despite the small size, port selection is very impressive. Put all this together and you have a mini PC that can handle just about any productivity or multimedia work you throw at it. Gaming at 1080p works decently too, thanks to the Iris Plus graphics. And the cooling system does a good job preventing thermal throttling, so performance stays consistent. Considering its high-end specs in such a tiny package, I had to give the B-Link SER3 the number one spot for best overall mini PC in 2023. For a balanced blend of power, portability, and price, the SER3 can't be beaten. Let me know down in the comments which mini PC is your personal favorite, and if I didn't mention your top pick, feel free to share. For more information and updated prices about the mini PCs mentioned, check the links in the description box below. Also, don't forget to drop a like on this video if you found it helpful, and make sure you're subscribed to the channel so you never miss any of our upcoming tech videos and reviews.